Spirit of Unity's online ministry. Here we stand again on the threshold of the holidays. And sometimes that's like a good news, bad news thing because as a minister, I cannot tell you how often I receive calls after the holidays with people feeling depressed and, and like something is missing. That is that all there is feeling about life. The feeling is very valid and it exists for a very logical reason. You see, although we spend much time preparing for the holidays, generally we are not prepared for the holidays. You're probably finding you're getting busy already. You may be thinking, not already. Here we go again. And it's such a paradox that on one hand, we we go, oh God, you know, here they're starting too early. And on the other hand, still within there is that stirring, that excitement, that something that we are anticipating and expecting from the holiday. Do we get it? We can. We may not. One of the reasons we may not get it, we're not prepared. Let's take a look at what a holiday is. A holiday is a day that is set aside a holy day to commemorate an event or an experience of God's presence and power in our lives. If we look at it as something else, we are not getting the benefit. It's like someone giving us a beautiful gift and say, isn't that the most beautiful gift in the world? And then we put it on a shelf so we can admire it. That's not the true value of the gift, nor is it the true value of the holidays. All of the preparations, all the preparations we're doing, all the, all the gift buying and giving, all of the visiting, all of the fixing, eating, enjoying food and parties and gatherings, that's only the wrapping. We want the true gift inside. And the true gift is the essence of the holiday, the holy day. What that day is about commemorating. If we ask ourselves, let's say with Thanksgiving coming up, what is Thanksgiving going to be like for you? Are you having family over or are you going to be with family or going out to dinner? Will you watch football on TV or surely someone's going to be playing It's a Wonderful Life? Those seem to be traditions, but they're not the pure essence, the principle, the reason for the holiday. The reason for the Thanksgiving holiday is to Give thanks, to pay attention, to ask yourself, what am I grateful for today? What has God blessed me with that I can remember? 
holiday sales, you don't have to interrupt your Thanksgiving and enjoying all the things you are thankful for to run out to any sale. Now, let's look quick at Black Friday. What's the motivation? The motivation behind Black Friday is, I better get this deal because there's not going to be another one. That is a lie. You are the beloved child of a wealthy father who showers you with every good thing. You will have more
light of God surround you. The love of God enfolds.